Hello everybody and welcome back. As you will notice, there is a banner over the video and that is simply because I recorded this while I was streaming and that is my streaming banner. I will leave links to where I stream in the description if you are interested in coming to see the next one. That's also why there's a lot of pauses throughout this. Uh, because I was taking time to interact with other people and I was also just I was struggling a lot with poses um, as you can see in the background I had a lot of ideas um, really wasn't sure what to do with this character and what direction I wanted to go so coming up with a pose to show off a personality was especially hard a few of my ideas revolved around her being shy or snooty but I really wanted to put a lot of energy into this character because I just, she was really cute and I wanted her to have a cute personality. I wanted to give her a really energetic pose because uh, as somebody who grants wishes, she would be, I imagine she would be super bubbly and excited, almost like a Pinkie Pie character, but not quite as energetic. You know, just a, a nice little in-between. I played around with the idea of giving her a tutu, but at the end I kind of scrapped it because there is already a lot of neat stuff going around with her character, so I didn't want to take away from it. For the colors, I wanted to make sure I got really nice bold outlines since sometimes my outlines blend a little bit too much with the fill and I wanted to make it stand out. Um, I really didn't care for the green that they did for her eye color, but it added a good amount of contrast. I didn't really like it at first because I didn't want her to look like Peachy Pie, um, but I didn't really have many better ideas at the time so I just kind of rolled with it. So my idea for this character is that um, she has a special talent with granting wishes, but because she's not a unicorn, she comes up with practical ways to grant wishes. Um, so, you know, doesn't really pay much attention to people, like silly wishes, like, oh man, I wish I had, you know, a giant sprinkle covered birthday cake like right now, but it's like, Oh man, I wish I had some better friends. She's like, oh shit, I know exactly the pony you need to meet, and that kind of like works that way. Just a very practical, but fun-loving, silly pony who likes to make pony's dreams come true because she is sweet and wholesome and I love her. I love how goofy she looks with her tongue sticking out. I just, she's very, goofy and lighthearted, and those are my favorite types of characters. So she is another like sherbet colored pony, 
So I decided I was gonna spice things up by adding some um, white splotches to her. And honestly, I think they are the most darling thing. I love them so much. When I colored in the eye, I realized that the spots were a little darker than I wanted and I wanted them to read a little bit whiter, so I adjusted the brightness a bit to try and make sure that they weren't pure white and there was contrast between the white and the sort of cream color that I used, but still make the cream color read as white. Honestly, I really love the fact that both her ears are visible. I think it is so cute. They look like they're like perked forward, which for horses kind of can mean that they're excited or happy. Um, so she's just very excited to be wherever she is. <laughs> I might use a character wheel in the future because I'm finding that a lot of my characters are ending up just a lot like Pinkie Pie, which is really funny because that's not even my favorite character. I just see these cute character designs that uh, G3 generated a lot of and it makes me think of her and so that's where a lot of the designs end up. So another challenge I can do to myself is creating characters with characteristics that I don't pick. I love that her cutie mark and her actual one looks so alike, but I also like that I uh, added some extra flair to her real life wand. I feel like that lime green just adds a little bit of spice that would look out of place as a cutie mark, but work so well as a prop. So the magic wand she has is totally just for show, um, but it also is like a little zipper pouch that has glitter in it, so she'll like unzip it a little and like, as she's like, quote, granting somebody's wish, she'll like sparkle them with glitter and bam, look, wish granted, because who doesn't love a little bit of glitter in their life? So that's the whole character. I hope you enjoyed and please consider liking and subscribing to see more videos like this in the future.